So Medline can be accessed through the A to Z of databases on um, library search. Um, and if you use the EBSCO Medline link, then you'll land on the basic search page. Here you can do a very quick and basic search for a topic. So if I was interested in the impact of chocolate on hypertension, I can simply search for chocolate hypertension and see what happens. Um, my search has found me 11 articles that I could look through, um, but I might want to do a more detailed search to make sure that I capture as much of the literature as possible. And to do that, it's a good idea to use the advanced search. And there's a link to that immediately underneath the search um, box. Clicking on here gives me a few different boxes that I can use. And the best way to use this is to separate out different concepts that are in your topic or question. So I've got chocolate in one box and hypertension in another box. Um, and then you can also add alternative words for the um, things that you're searching for. So where I've got chocolate, I can put chocolate or cocoa or cacao. Um, which are all different ways of um, potentially talking about chocolate in an academic context. So I'm making sure that it doesn't matter which word the author of the article has used, I will still find that um, article through my search on Medline. And where I had 11 articles before, um, this has now gone up to 197. So I found a, a much um, wider range of potentially relevant literature. Uh, once you've done this, you can start to use options on the left hand side to narrow things down. So, for instance, we've got the date to find uh, recent literature. Um, I can use the linked full text option, uh, which will narrow it down just to articles that Christchurch has got access to. Um, and further down that left hand column, there are many more options for um, narrowing your search down, such as by the, the language uh, or the age of the participants in research and so on. Um, on your list of results, um, you can see a lot of information about each article. If you click the title, it will give you an abstract of the article um, and the full text finder button will take you through Christchurch's systems to get the article that you um, want to use. There are other features on uh, Medline that you can use as well. So if you use MeSH or medical subject headings, there is a link to that um, at the top, um, MeSH 2021, it says here. Um, and if you want to look back at the searches that you've done um, on that particular occasion that you're logged in, if you click search history, it will show you a list of the searches that you've done and allow you to rerun them which can be quite handy if you decide that actually what you did 10 minutes ago was more helpful than what you've got now. So that's a very quick overview of Medline, um, a very useful database for um, finding biomedical literature. I hope you found that helpful and happy searching.